do that. Talk to him, and I talk to him. I don't know. Why don't you tell him about the story about how Gordon met Percy and how Percy's now bleeding from his fucking eye sockets? Hello? Do you have Peter Tench? What, you mean this dickhead with the silly face tattoos? Yeah, he sat right here. And the briefcase? Yes, of course I've got the case. Oh, lemon. Tangerine. You're bleeding, mate. Oh, mate, shit. Oh, oh shit, man. Who the fuck did I kill? Get a wet one on it or something. Oh, it's not my mate. <laughs> oh, it's not yours? <laughs> yeah, I know. I don't bleed. Oh, in that case, just leave your jacket open, let everyone have a good old look. Yeah, I want everyone yeah, to see yeah. my tie. What the fuck is wrong with you? Pull your coat together so no one else notices, Lemon. Can I please go do my job now? If something oh, is very kind on. of you. Thank you very much. Fuck me! Jesus Christ! It's very rude talking on the phone on the train in Japan. This rude enough for you, you fucking prick. Shove that fucking hat up your fucking arsehole, you hear me? Well, if we do get back and they say it's just a non issue, you just come back around, you know, and see what the. Oh my god! Okay, okay. Oh, shit. You know, I know a thing or two about being a parent, but you know what I would do? Being that it's your son and your money, I'd stop crying about your dead wife, get off your fucking lazy ass, come here and finish the job yourself. But as we're having a bit of a heart to heart, I've got a couple of things to tell you. Your son's a complete belly and fucking deserves to be bleeding out of his eye sockets. And as for your case, I haven't seen it since Tokyo. And I hope someone's fucking found it, put it all on red, and having a fucking wonderful time. I will meet you at Kyoto Station. Oh, how wonderful. I can't fucking wait. <laughs>